Hi, good morning. It's Friday, November 20th, 2015. This is Jake from Polygon.com to talk about Xur's inventory for the weekend. Xur is the exotic gear merchant in Destiny, and we're a couple months now into the Taken King, uh, so a lot of people are going to have everything that Xur's selling. It's late level 280, so that might not be you know high enough to matter for you. Um, Bungie announced that they're going to be introducing some refreshed year one exotics uh, next month, so you may want to hold on to your coins at this point You know, if you're sort of unenthused about the stuff that he's brought. Um, but that being said, still a few people out there climbing that light ladder trying to fill out their exotic collections. Uh, so first up is Immolation Fists. These are Titan Gloves for Sunbreakers. Uh, it grants explosive pyre, meaning that you can use Flame Seeker or uh, you know, one of the other perks there. Uh, I really like these, especially in Crucible, because explosive pyre is pretty much necessary for Sunbreaker to be uh, the godlike super that it is, um, and then you can get tracking hammers. Also great for PvE if you're not running something else. Um, you know, you can re all these, uh, Xur's got all gloves this week, so you can always use Twist Fate to re-roll for the, um, weapon type of your choosing. Don't touch me. These are Hunter Gloves. Uh, taking damage from a melee attack makes you briefly invisible. This plays well with Blade Dancer. Um, unfortunately, you know, Blade Dancer's kind of fallen off a little bit for utility since, uh, it's so easy to become invisible with Night Stalker, so, um, still, you know, still kind of a, a cool niche piece of equipment. But I don't, I don't really recommend them. I don't, I don't use them. Claws of Ahamkara. These are great utility uh, gloves for warlocks. Gains an additional melee charge. That doesn't matter what uh, subclass you're running. So Flame Shield when you're running Sun uh, Sunsinger is it's really great to have two of those. Um, again, you can reroll the the weapon type, and it's just generally a decent exotic to have. Uh, exotic Ingram for chest this week. So. Uh, if you don't have all the chess pieces by now, um, you know, always good to give this a shot. Uh, rem reminder that the exotic engram doesn't necessarily decrypt uh, for something for your class, and the legacy engram is going to be a year one uh, light level weapon. So don't buy that if you're looking for something new. It's just for filling out your collection. Uh, that's it for this weekend, and I hope you have a wonderful day.